Hey, what's up everybody? This is Osterberg501 and today I want to go over some new news for Lost Ark and that is some new information on new content we will be getting in the March update. So today we're reviewing some of the new key features releasing in March and in the near future we'll share a roadmap that covers the top additions coming to Arcasia over the next few months. And this is content that we'll be releasing in March. Please note the following features are not a complete list of content in including Included in the March update, additional changes and fixes are in progress, and they'll share comprehensive release notes closer to when the update launches. So the first bit of content is Story Episode Caden, which includes Asteri and Illusion Bamboo Islands. Experience a new storyline complete with its own quests, new islands, and cinematic moments. These quests will include a cast of new and returning characters as you learn more about the side reels and search for the legendary Caden, the first guardian slayer in your journey to find the final arc. Players will need to have completed Phaeton alongside completing the following quests, Yorn Let There Be Light, Whispering, Islet, Start of Our Story, and Illusion Bamboo Island, End of the Trials. These are all a prerequisite before embarking on the new endgame questline. Both Asteri and Illusion Bamboo Islands are recommended for players at item level 1100, which is in tier 3. So I'm pretty sure all of this additional content in March is going to to be tier 3 content. And then the second thing revealed is Abyss Raid Argos. Encounter an entirely new endgame activity, Abyss Raid. Similar to Guardian Raids, players will need to work together to defeat a Guardian before the time expires. With a limited number of revives available to the party, Abyss Raids will pit 8 players against a Guardian, but these are bigger, badder, and much more difficult than your average Guardians. Players will need to progress through 3 distinct phases as they work together to vanquish their titanic foe. In the three phases, the Guardian will grow more powerful with different mechanics and attack patterns. Each phase has its own rewards collectible once a week and different item level requirements for players to participate. Argos will be available through the Abyss Raid statue in major cities. This isn't all the content that will be included in the March update, so stay tuned for the full release notes including details on additional changes and bug fixes. We'll share more including the date and planned downtime closer to when the update is ready. So there's a lot more content and additional changes that will be in this March content update, but most likely these are going to be the most substantial content additions in this update. So essentially the content that's been revealed to us for this update is a new main quest line and it's going to be similar to all the other main quest lines that take you to different continents. This is also where we get the seventh arc to complete the collect all the arcs quest and that will include two additional islands. And then then we're getting the first Abyss Raid, which is Argos, and these are going to be eight player raids that have three different fights in them. You'll be facing the same boss, but it will be split up into three different parts that all give their own loot. And keep in mind that these aren't the Legion raids, and also keep in mind that these aren't the Legion raids. Legion raids are the biggest, most difficult end game raids. These are a different raid system, but these will also still be pretty difficult. I would most likely recommend you don't match make these and you actually look for or start up a group in the group finder instead that'll allow you to find much more competent groups to try to complete this content and that's pretty much everything we know about the march content update so far pretty exciting even with the only content we know we're getting we're still getting a decent bit of additional content and i'm really excited for the roadmap whenever that comes out to show what we're getting past this because we already know they plan on giving us a new class every two to three months we know that the legion raids will most likely be be coming out in April with how they've been talking about it and now knowing some of the main content we're getting in March. But that's pretty much all I want to go over with this new content. So subscribe if you want to see more Lost Ark or other MMO videos. Leave a like if you liked the video. Leave a comment down below what you guys think about this new content update and thanks for watching.